Good day, dear my students. You are welcome to my English lesson. I am Kubayev Janajmaba. The theme of the lesson, unit revision. Lesson number 12, module number 1. Today we'll conclude our model. Learning objectives. 10, 3, 7. Use appropriate subject-specific vocabulary and syntax to talk about a range of general and the curricular topics. 10, 6, 9. Use appropriately a wide variety of active and passive simple, present and the past forms and past perfect simple forms in narrative and reported speech on a wide range of familiar, general and the curricular topics. So look at this diagram. Today we'll revision our model, legend or trust. What have you learned at the model? Vocabulary in speaking skills, reading, writing, use of English, and a clear lesson or culture. What have you learned about vocabulary? We talk about survival, about weather, about feeling, and the phrasal verbs give, put, and ing or ed adjectives. Now, what is survival? What kind of four texts we have read about, about survival? Extreme weather. Do you remember extreme weather's vocabulary? Speaking, acting out an interview, narrating an experience, and presenting a famous person. In reading skills, we have read about the wildest dream. It is a documentary film. We do many tasks, multiple choice, and answer the questions. We read text about home is where the yard is. We describe the yard and do many tasks. In writing skills, a diary entry about an expedition, a post about a famous person, and we wrote an article. Use of English. What kind of tenses we use it at the lesson? We use it past tenses, present perfect simple, present perfect continuous, past modals of deduction, adverbs, conjunctions, and exclamations. About clear lesson or culture, it is a literature. We have read about the sea wolf and the culture spot about Robinson Crusoe. Let's do vocabulary. Match the words with the translation. There are 10 words. Conquer. Mountain range. Blizzard, heat wave, thunderstorm, nomad, step, cruel, species, war. Now match the words with the translation, please. Thank you. Do the task. 
vocabulary and grammar. Vocabulary. Choose the correct word. There are five sentences. Grammar. Put the verbs in brackets into the correct past tense. There are five sentences. Do the task, please. About phrasal verbs. Phrasal verbs give and phrasal verbs put. Look at the diagram. Read and translate phrasal verbs. Give. Give back. Give over. Give away. Give up. Give in. Give out. Give off. Give on to. Good. The next phrasal verbs put. Let's read and translate. Put out. Put off. Put back. Put aside. Put over. Put up. Put on. Put up with. Put down. Put about. Put forth. Very nice. Thank you. Grammar. We have learned past tenses. How we use past continuous. What is an auxiliary verb of past continuous? Yes, you are right. Was where plus main verb ing. For example, Jenny was cooking dinner at 10 last night. Was cooking. Past continuous. How we use past perfect? Yes, you are right. Subject plus had plus past participle of the main verb. Past perfect continuous. Subject plus had been plus main verb ing. About adverbs. Adverbs of with adjectives, adverbs or verbs. Comparative and superlative adjectives. Let's do test. There are 10 questions. Choose the correct answer, please. Do the test. Let's conclude our model. Now, what have you learned at this model about lexical competence, about reading competence, listening, speaking competence, and writing competence? In lexical, you have read about and talk about survival, about extreme weather, about feelings. Thank you. The lesson is over. Thank you for your attention. You are super. See you the next lesson. Goodbye.